Okay, Randy has his hands full. This one is a doll. So uh, Caramel is part of a very large litter that went through our foster care program. She's also hard to hold on to. She has uh, litter mates, uh, Chatter, Shadow, Sharon, Evan, Bear, and Annie. There are so many of them that they're not even all in the same cage. So uh, this little girl is ready for adoption. In fact, she's already been spayed. So uh, that will make it, um, it can make it a little faster to get her home. During this time of year, we uh, always do surgeries three days a week. And during this time of year, whenever there are spaces on the surgery schedule, we fill them with kittens because we know that they're gonna get adopted. What you normally do when you come to the shelter to adopt is uh, you choose a pet that you like, we put them on the surgery schedule and set up a time for you to come in and have an interview. And the interview really isn't um, to ask you anything we haven't already asked on the application. It's to let you ask us questions about pet care and us to give you information about integrating a new pet into your family the easiest way you can. And oftentimes when people come in and talk to me about getting a um, pet and we you know, give the different tips on how you can do it, this is great. Randy has a laser pointer, which uh, Caramel is very much enjoying. Um, we want to tell you the easiest way to bring a new pet into the home. But if you have experience and you have your own way of doing it, that's great. It's just that a lot of people come to the shelter with, um, without a lot of it experience. And oftentimes people will tell me, we got a dog, it was easy, the dog just automatically was wonderful. Or a cat found us 10 years ago and just became a great pet. So you may have never done it. You may have never brought home a pet um, that might need some training. Um, so there are a lot of ways that we can tell you uh, to make it easier, and we hope you'll be able to put some of those ideas to use. I have had people who have had cats and dogs all their lives, and uh, they come into the interview thinking, what can the shelter lady possibly tell me about cats that I don't already know, and end up in the middle of the interview saying, wow, that is some useful information. So we hope that happens for everybody, that we make it worth your while and then you take them home. The advantage to us putting the kittens on the surgery schedule prior to them being chosen is it means we can make the interview appointment that much quicker because we need to get them out of here to make room for all of the kittens that are in our full foster homes. So I don't really need to say much about Caramel. She is beautiful and she's cute, well socialized, and she's gonna make somebody really happy as will all of her brothers and sisters, one of whom you're gonna meet in just a moment.